For decades, the United States has forged incredible, unshakable bonds with our Central American partners in every respect, historical, diplomatic, military, cultural, economic, and academic. The fact that several high-level U.S. government officials, from Vice President Kamala Harris to, the Sec to Secretary of State Blinken, to USAID Administrator Power have, all, have already visited this region, shows just how intertwined and important Central American security is with United States national security. That's why our security partnership is so robust. Our military traditions are founded on democratic values like the rule of law, the professional, apolitical nature of the military, commitment to free and fair elections, gender equality, and human rights. We're also committed to peace and security around the world. Several of us, and these nations sitting here at the table, several of us send our troops overseas to participate in global peacekeeping operations, like Salvadoran troops in Mali, or Guatemalan Kabyles, I hope I said that right, Kabyles in the Congo. But we are also connected by the cross-cutting threats that we face and the collective challenges that they pose. We must work together to keep our region, our neighborhood safe. 